Hi, how are we today? Today we are doing a request. It's actually been requested. We're gonna do my favorite bags. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna show you my favorite bag. Sara is not next to me today. Isn't that crazy? She's actually busy. She's cooking dinner for us. So it will just be you and me, very intimate. And I have a bunch of bags here that you guys can't see, but I'm gonna bring them out one by one and I'm going to explain why I love it and how I wear it, blah, 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 blah. It's gonna be a mixture of different prices. The more expensive ones are honestly my mum's, but she doesn't wear them, so I wear them for her. And most of them are also vintage because she got them a while ago. That's mainly why I love them them so much because they're like vintage style i'll show you let's do this one first this one has been highly um no mama the chicken okay back to the video this bag has been highly stolen <laughs> what's the word vintage. no i'm trying to say that i They've seen it a lot on my Instagram. Worn, it's famous in my Instagram. Hi, it's been worn a lot. Has been, you've been, you've seen it. If you follow me on Instagram, then you've seen this bag. And it is my mum's bag. She's looking at me now. It's denim. It's like not a saddle bag, but is a saddle bag at the same time. It hasn't got that kidney bean shape, but it's got much, in my opinion, a much it's cuter. After the saddle round the shape it's apparently limited edition after the saddle bag was released they released this and it's so cute look it's got this like detail here it just gives me like britney hit me baby one more time it's got these little zippers the inside is really cute monogrammed which i wish can you see that how nice and like oh 90s is that and it's in such good condition because she doesn't wear her bags she just hoards them i get to enjoy it as if it was new it goes with basically anything i wear it with jeans a lot because like denim on denim i also would wear it with like a color blocked outfit like earlier today actually but i'm not wearing it right now today i wore all pink outfit out and about and i wore blue laura pianas and this would match that perfectly like i would even wear it with this it matches my nails ish Next bag, we'll keep with the blue theme. This is also one of my absolute faves. This is relatively new. We got it like two years ago. It's a nice Versace, Versace, Versace moment. I'm not sure the name of the bag to be honest because I don't really, I'm not the one that does all the research on the bags. My sister and my mum do all the research and then we buy them and we share them because like why not? Sharing is caring. I don't understand people that don't share with their family. Yeah. It's just like a really cute shoulder moment. The only annoying thing about this bag is the leather's so soft that it doesn't hold its shape properly and it can look a bit, if you're wearing it for pick, especially if there's something heavy inside, it can look a bit not so great. So you need to keep it light. You need to not have a lot of stuff in it. Just like basically a card and some lipstick and that's it. Cause you don't want it to be too heavy and droop. But it's really cute. I feel like it's more of an evening bag. I wear it to like dinners and stuff less. Well, Sarah has worn it a lot, my sister has worn it a lot as a daytime bag but personally i wear it to like dinners slightly fancier outfits slightly fancier days but you can wear it with anything so i wear it with jeans and t-shirts a lot nothing too wild anyway we're moving out of blue and into green not luxury but like mid mid tier it's like it's affordable it's like a hundred dollars ish but i'm sure you guys have seen this if not on me on someone else i have a discount code i will put it in the description i don't make any money off the discount code it's just for you guys it's vegan leather this i believe they named it after Gigi hadid i think she wore it um, i don't know how to pronounce the brand name i say Jouet, but it might be jwp jw pi let me put the name closer so you can read Jouet. Okay, I think it's really, I think it's quite a unique style. It's like bags at this price point, I find usually are dupes for other bags, which is like amazing. But I think this one seems really unique. I don't have anything in mind that it's copying. It's so unique, it's so cute. I really like the scrunched detail that they have going on. And it's really like, it's a nice big loop for your arm to go in. It goes really well with this jumper actually. I feel like everything's gotten nice with this jump. Sure. Yeah, it's got like a little magnet to close it. It goes all the way, it's just got a little button, so things will spill out if you've got, if you're just like 
chucking it around, which you shouldn't do anyway. Never put your bag on the floor, you guys. It's bad luck, so don't do that. Put your bag on the floor and your money's at the door. That's the saying, so don't do it. More green coming up. I really love the colour green, as you can see. Mint green bag. My favourite colour is actually purple, but I don't have a lot of purple bags. I have like one or two. There's one purple bag in this favourites collection that I will show you later. This sneak peek. This is also Mum's. It's a beautiful, would you call this tweed? It's a beautiful tweed, green tweed. Really classy. I feel like such a lady when I carry this bag. Oh, it's just so beautiful, don't you think? But I'm obsessed with it. I don't wear it a lot because I just want to cherish it. I don't want anything to happen to it. Even though I do say you have to wear your things, which I do, I've worn this, like, don't get me wrong but i just want to make sure i wear it on the right days also i find bigger bags are not are like less every day than, i don't know why i just prefer to carry it as an everyday bag a smaller bag because i feel like i can just grab it and go like i don't like to lug around big bags especially because i like to walk places i don't want to walk around with like huge bags and like heavy stuff i like to be really light and like small bag but this it's like a dinner bag wear it with something green if i'm feeling crazy i might wear it to the mall if i'm like really feeling wild that day i want to wear some jeans and oh do you know what this would be nice with i think it's more something yeah that's true christmasy london energy comes from this I don't bag know why we got it with us, to be honest. yeah this is much more of a london bag i'm obsessed with it i'm obsessed with it i think it's really classy it reminds me of like it reminds me of like <laughs> i don't even know the queen love it and it's huge it like fits a lot inside but anyway let's move on to like browns autumnal colors because we're moving into autumn so lv cute i wear this bag a lot because it's I, I like the size of it the only annoying thing is my phone gets a bit awkward in there so i have to carry my phone in my hand because of the shape of it it doesn't quite fit but it's such a cute shape i really love it i don't like soft bags in this shape I, but i like that it's like a suitcase do you know what i mean really nice it goes with everything you can wear it casual dressy whatever it doesn't matter cute little moment beautiful you fit your lipstick your cards and that's all you need it's like about the size of my head can you tell me when it's three minutes yeah okay so far messaged me nice. why did he send me this i don't know if i like sage you don't like sage Anyway, this little clutch, really cute. It's just like easy, you can pick it up, walk around. I really love this shape, I think it's so sweet. It's a really nice autumn color. It's a really beautiful chocolate brown. And because there's no branding on it, you really don't need to buy the real thing. Like you can just get duped. Love this bag, I actually wear it so much. It's one of my go-tos because it's also it's small. As I said, I like small bags. Also because, you know when you go to a restaurant, I don't like to put my bag on the floor. If it's small, you can just put it on the edge of the table. If it's huge, it like takes up the whole table. You have to ask a bag stool. And I don't like being that girl that's like, can I have a bag stool? Because it's so awkward. When it's small, edge of the table, nobody complains. Really cute and it fits everything. This fits my phone. Because like, you put your phone that way, it just closes on top of it. My phone, my cards, my ID, my lipstick, my hand sanitizer, everything fits in here. Even though this one's bigger, because of the shape, this one fits so much more inside. Fun fact. Okay, next bag. No. This, so very autumnal, brown. This is vintage as well. This is my mum's from like the 90s, probably before I was born, yeah, when I was still brewing. This also gives me London vibe. It's really, it gives me like model, model off duty bag. Look at that. It's Gucci. Does it say Gucci? Yeah, it does say Gucci. Very minimal labels, which I like. I think it's really, even though I did give you, show you a monogram and a bag as one of my faves. I do like minimal labels. I think it's really classy. It's coming back, you know? What, this bag or? Yeah. It's coming back, the shape, but not the... The shape is really in style right now. The colors are really beautiful. It's amazing. It's a lovely bag. I really love it. Next bag. So we're moving out of browns, out of autumn and into black. Let me show you my favorite black bag. Another Chanel. How amazing is this Chanel? Is this caviar? Sarah? Yes, my mum bought as well, so this is hers, but I wear it a lot. It's, I believe, caviar. It's got silver hardware. It's really huge, to be honest, but it goes with everything. This is like the perfect, any color, any outfit, this bag. 
I like to wear it to the mall, to be honest. I think it makes me feel like really like, ugh, I've got so much to do, you know what I mean? Not on a mall where I'm just like, mm, not on a mall. On a day where I'm feeling to wear a big bag, this is my favorite big bag to wear. I wear this quite often. If I have to hold stuff, if I have to carry a lot of stuff one day, I wear this bag. Basically, if it's everything, if it's documents, it goes with everything. Look at that, boop. So cute, amazing, amazing, right? One of my babies. Simple black Chanel. I think if you're going to start investing in bags, a simple black Chanel is your best friend. I'm just stroking her. And make sure you treat your bags with care. Wear them, but make sure you take care of them. Don't squidge them. Don't like shove them in drawers. Don't put them on the floor. If you're going out, put them in the chair next to you. Ask for a bag store, all that stuff. That'd be your best piece. Evening bag. Black evening bag. I want to feel like extra evening one day. If I'm going to like a dinner with a large group of people and I'm wearing like heels and I'm wearing a dress. Go to bag, Versace clutch, fits lipstick. It's got a little chain. I have one denim in here. Boop, one denim. Not very big. It doesn't fit my phone. Does it? No, it doesn't fit my phone. It's just about the same size as my phone. But it will fit lipstick. It will fit your wallet. It will fit cash. And that's probably enough. Do you know what I mean? Like you don't really need anything else if you're going to dinner. I wouldn't wear this in the middle of the day. I think this is very much an evening bag. I wouldn't go to the mall with this, but it's beautiful. Look at the details. It's like embroidered, got this beautiful button there. Really nice. I also um, try to match my jewelry to the hardware of the bag. If I'm wearing gold hardware, like a bag with gold hardware, I would try and wear jewelry that's gold. It's not like the end of the world if it doesn't really match or I don't find anything because no one's really looking, but it's just nice. It's nice to feel cohesive and feel coordinated. So tip, if you like really want to feel good about the outfit, coordinate yourself, bag and shoes, hardware and jewelry. That's the vibes. Okay. This cute little white bag now. This is actually, this has a hairband inside, hold on. This cute little bag, this is actually brandless. I bought it at like some sort of market, but it looks kind of like those LV bags. I'll put a picture of them here if I find find it. Those bags that are like this shape. It's so cute, I wear it so much. It's like faux ostrich. Do you see? It's like so ostrich. Got a bit dirty because I've worn it so much. Well, not dirty, but like it's clearly worn. It fits my phone, so it's like perfect. As soon as a bag fits my phone, but it's still tiny, that's like, see, fits my phone. It's like, oh my God, heaven. So cute. If you follow me on Instagram, you've definitely seen this in some pictures. I don't tag it because it's, you won't be able to find it. It's just a random market. And it's really cute. There's actually no label. Even inside, there's no name. So I couldn't even tell you where I was from. Obsessed with it. And it's like faux gold hardware as well. Really nice, goes with everything. Day and night, any color. So cute. Um, let's do a thumbnail. Put one on each shoulder. 